Breaking news. The accused Seminole Heights killer and his parents just facing a judge minutes ago. We're also learning how old Donaldson III just found out this morning that he's facing the death penalty. Let's go to ABC Action News reporter Lauren Rosella, who's live outside the courthouse for us with the potential trouble now his parents are still facing. Lauren. Absolutely. Good morning, James and Dia. Yes, so this uh, Howard Donaldson III just went before a judge. Uh, his parents sitting right there in court. I want you to take a look at some video of this court hearing. You can see um, his parents are sitting there. He's sitting there as lawyers kind of debate what the next few months are going to look like. Uh, the big thing here in this court hearing is that the prosecutors say that his parents aren't cooperating with investigators and now they are dealing with contempt charges and will have to go through a hearing. Their hearing is also tied to their son's case very directly. Now we all know that Howard Donaldson III is accused of killing four people in the Seminole Heights neighborhood. Now I was watching this court hearing his parents sitting right there in the background watching this whole thing uh, be debated. They appeared calm, uh, very collected, not really showing much emotion. Their son leaving the courtroom without really even being able to acknowledge his parents. They didn't seem to be looking at each other or anything as he was led out of the courtroom in handcuffs. Now coming up, uh, we have just found out when he's going to next be in court. It looks like Donaldson will be in court again uh, in June, uh, about June 12th, and his parents in their contempt hearing will be in mid-February. We'll have more updates on this coming up at 930. Reporting live in Hillsborough County this morning, Lauren Rosella, ABC Action News.